Once, a very long time ago, there was a young man and a young woman, and they got married, and they built themselves a small house on top of a hill. The land where they lived was dry and hot, and it was rare that they even saw a drop of rain. And as they had no wa running water in the house, the man, twice a day, would walk down a little dusty track down to the river. Across his back he carried a pole from which two large clay pots hung for carrying water, one on each side of him. So it was that he carried water each day. And time passed, and he grew from being a young man to becoming an older man. But all the time he carried the same two pots, only one of the pots had a small crack in it and through this crack water would leak out. So much so that by the time the man had reached his home, there were only a few drops of water left. The other pot considered himself perfect and could not understand why the man would keep a pot with a crack in it. So, each time as the man walked up the hill and the pots swung behind the old man's back. Well, the perfect pot would taunt and tease the cracked pot. He'd say such things like, You're rubbish, you are. I can't understand why he keeps a pot with a crack in it. What's the use of that? All the water's gone. You're good for nothing. I suspect he only keeps you because he's sorry for you. Well, the cracked pot would say nothing, but the taunting hurt, and he had to listen to it twice a day, day after day, day after day, until one day he'd had enough. And when the old man had returned home and he put the pots on the ground, the cracked pot said to him, Man, why do you keep me? What's the point of me? I'm useless. You see, there's no water left inside me. Why don't you throw me away? Get yourself a new pot. I've got a crack and I'm not perfect. Oh, my old friend, said the old man. I am so sorry. I didn't realise you felt like that. Why, you're so important to me. I could, I could never get rid of you. You don't know what it is that makes you so special to me. You see, your water leaks out and it waters one side of the path as I walk up the hill. A long time ago, I planted some seeds of flowers there and your water has made those flowers grow into the most beautiful things I see and smell on my walk up the hill. Turn around and have a look. And the cracked pot did turn around and he looked down the old dusty track and there he saw on one side of that track the most beautiful flowers, reds and yellows and blues and the old man said, I can never get rid of you. You know, it's our cracks that make us who we are. And you, crackpot, are very special to me.